Hi y'all, it's Pam again with Mason Lance Designs and we're back for another um, Zoom Notes video. And um, today we're gonna look at this top, up at the very top, this button um, that have the arrows on it is the Zoom button. And honestly, I've not used it for Zoom. I've not used any of these features. What I do know is that you can sit and change your tabs with it. Okay, that's how you change your tabs. Now, you can also press, I'm sorry, press the text tool and see, I've watched a video where they say that you don't have to necessarily press that zoom button at the top to uh, make your links to work, but so far I've not, I've not found that exactly true. I'm not sure what she was doing that she was able to do that. Now, when you press it, um, with your finger, you know, instead of your Apple Pencil, it doesn't matter what tool you want, you're on, okay? You can do that. But I found if you're just using your Apple Pencil, this is the best way to navigate your links. Is just by making sure that that's on. And I'm sure I should have done that one of the first videos because that was one of the things I wanted to know in the beginning is how do I make my links work? So, um... And I'm sorry these videos uh, aren't explaining exactly every feature that's in each of these tools. I know when I was learning, it was too much to know all the features. I just wanted to know what I needed to know to basically use um, the tools button, you know, use each of the buttons and what they can do for me. And so that's kind of how I'm trying to do these videos is so, you know, you can learn basically just what you need to know to get started with using it. And then in time, you'll be able to learn you know, more about each tool because there's a lot more I need to learn. I'm just excited about what I've learned so far and how much it's helped me in my planning. So we'll talk to you later in another Zoom Notes video. Thank you for watching. Bye.